Let's go to Victor in Paramus, New Jersey. Hey, Victor, what's going on? Not much. Uh, FCX, the earnings come out tomorrow. And then look at the symbol X. Why, where do you think that's going? But FCX, the earnings come out tomorrow, and it's taking a little beating. Yeah, so this is going to be interesting. The free, Freeport Mac Moran has been on a tear. I mean, and I see it on there, Victor. The Bloomberg is saying maybe Thursday pre-market for Freeport. Oh, so tomorrow morning the earnings come out. All right, uh, well, no, um, uh, maybe, we got... maybe you're right. Yeah. Well, I don't know, whatever. Yeah, just for, for what it's worth. Yeah, this is telling us Thursday, right? Yeah. Yeah. So you have, let's see, so this is, it's going to be interesting. This is a complex ABC up. It took out the B it's point. A yeah, it's like a 15-something. Let's see, you got 13.38, 10.70, so about 3 bucks, which 250. is. 250. Yeah, so it's 15 bucks, right? Yeah. So it's a complex ABC structure up. You know, I mean, it got hit out here today, but it looks like it's going to reject lower price at this 12.32. Um, you know, it's been on a good tear, man. I mean, I, I, my take is that it doesn't want to go up to this $15 level. And we'll see, you know, that, that swing point is kind of hanging out there. At both times that it went higher, you know, you can see that expansion of volume. So it's still saying it wants higher price. Um, you go over to the U.S. stale, that's in trouble. That's always been in trouble. Yeah, is that... Is that like going to turn into Bethlehem Steel and just go bankrupt and go bye bye, or what do you think? They it seems that the, uh, you know, they've been losing money forever. I mean, let me just yeah, see right. if they're still losing money. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, you know, it blows my mind that they're still in business, but so yeah, they got earnings a week out from tomorrow. Yeah, and they're, they're still, still losing money. So, well, they're losing money the 2019, 2020, 2021, right? Yeah. yeah. Um, you know, but we need a steel company, so they can't let them all go out of business. That's the other side of this. That's, you know. Yeah. That's, you know. True, true. So, you know, I wouldn't be buying it, that's for sure. I mean, this thing looks to me that, yeah, you get six bucks on the agenda again. What is that right there? Eight, well, 852 first. But you can see that this is, this has been in trouble for a long period of time. And that's regardless of the tariffs that go put in. Um, you know, basically... Yeah, they the, were supposed to get some help. Yeah, the administration basically did everything to keep the sale companies alive, and it didn't work, because it's basically... It is yeah. what it is. You know what I mean? Because I think Alcoa came out with some crappy earnings, too. Yeah, so makes sense. Uh, I, which company? No, Alcoa came out with some bad earnings. Alcoa, 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 yeah. Alcoa. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's been a dog forever. What happens with Alcoa is that the, the, even with the energy costs coming down... It takes so much energy to make aluminum, man, that they just never have seemed to be able to really get to higher price, you know, because they're in a business it, it, that's and, very uh, expensive. Where do you think IBM is going after the close? IBM, oh, my God. You like all these old dogs. Let's see. Well, they pay dividends. I don't know. There's supposedly this new uh, technology coming out with quantum computing and uh, I mean, I Yeah, uh, I know. We've seen the, and the, the NFL. They were the main sponsor were they? this okay. weekend, yeah. I wouldn't be buying. I mean, this is already telling me it's rejecting higher price out here this morning. Come into the gap. Right. Couldn't, couldn't hold price. Go to 126. There's a gap at 126. 130. Mm -hmm. one, yeah, you get a 128 high volume. Let me put this on a weekly for a second. Weekly. Then I'll close the gap. If the gap's down tomorrow, night, maybe it's a buy. Yeah. What all no, I, I can see that. You know, that's a big consolidation. I mean, you know, IBM's not going away. That's for sure. But I don't think right. they've... They, they certainly, yeah, 127's game. They, they haven't got the traction, and we know that, you know, what they should have done is this cloud computing had, should have been growing like crazy, and it's not. And that's a big problem. Oh, that's right. They bought Red Hat, too. That's right. Yep. Yeah. You know, and that's, you know, they were in there early enough, but they just didn't perform like yeah. Google performed and like uh, Microsoft and Amazon. You well, know? Look at the revenue, man. They're, they're stagnant from 2016 to 2021. Yeah. Which is crazy in the business, isn't area. it? Yeah. And if you then if you take that, and then this number keeps going down, the number of employees, and that's how they keep the at least the you know the profitability. Profit, costs, yeah. 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 Somewhat. So. Yeah. So. Mm -hmm. Thank God for uh, thank God for share buyback, right? Right. That's right. Well, no, saved no, a lot that, of companies. That's, exactly. That's how they've been yeah. doing it. There's no doubt, man. Cooking, brother. Uh, Thanks, Victor. Have a great one, man. Have a safe one.